This week, Tesla unveiled a new all-wheel drive version of the Model S electric car, along with a super performance 691 horsepower version. Porsche unveiled the 911 GTS, and the Aeromobile flying car nears production. It's the week in reverse, right here at Motor Authority. There are many things which make a Rolls Royce a Rolls Royce, but only one is essential, a certain attitude. The Ghost Series 2 delivers that attitude in spades. What is that attitude? It's an air of significance combined with an overt desire for exquisite luxury. The experience of that attitude results in a car, and an experience, that makes it clear the person inside is someone who matters, whether they're driving or riding peacefully in the rear. Find out more about the 2015 Rolls-Royce Ghost Series 2 in our first drive report at Motor Authority. The Tesla Model S is a beautiful car and it has a large and fervent fan base. That fan base is sure to grow on Thursday night's news of a new dual motor option that brings up to 691 horsepower and all-wheel drive to the all-electric party. 0 to 60 miles per hour, 3.2 seconds, acclaimed fastest ever time for a four-door car, electric or not. It's darned impressive and we can't wait to get our hands on one. An autonomous Audi RS7 will lap the Hockenheim ring at full race pace this weekend, Audi announced this week. The idea is to show off the technology behind Audi's piloted driving autonomous system while at the same time demonstrating that its capabilities lie far beyond the requirements of everyday use. Audi claims the system can keep pace with a professional racing driver, but we'll have to wait to see how the actual demonstration goes this weekend to know for sure. The 2015 Chevrolet Camaro is looking for a new name for a new special edition. The new car will be unveiled at SEMA and will go on sale to the public early next year, but fans will be the ones to name it. If you've always wanted to put your stamp on a car's nameplate, here's your chance. Porsche unveiled the 2015 911 Carrera GTS this week, revealing a car that's just a bit sharper, more capable, and sexier than the standard Carrera or Carrera S, without some of the compromises the GT3 brings to the table or the extreme cost of the 911 Turbo. The new GTS starts from $115,195 for the coupe and is expected to hit American streets soon. And way back on Monday of this week, we brought you news of the Aeromobile flying car and its imminent production-ready status. While the idea of a flying car remains highly impractical for most drivers and pilots, for the lucky few, the Aeromobile might be the perfect dual-mode transport system. It also looks like tons of fun. You'll find all of this and more each week at Motor Authority, so be sure to follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter to catch the latest as it happens. 